Hey everybody. So I'm out scouting a piece of public ground with a buddy of mine today. It's a wow, is it a phenomenal piece of ground. Very, very nice piece of public ground. And and it's in a great area too. But I don't think he gets a lot of hunt pressure because he sat it last year and he saw a lot of deer in his two sits. And he even shot a buck. He just had never shot a buck with his bow, so he took the first one that came by, which was a yearling buck, but um, he saw it well before, probably an hour and a half before last light, and he had already seen a bunch of deer by then. So very good piece of public. So just something to encourage you guys that hunt a lot of public that you can definitely find some golden nuggets. But this is kind of cool in this spot. I just wanted to show three different stages of growth with this aspen. So we got mature growth aspen here. Then right here, you swing this way, it's probably, I would guess, 15 year old growth aspen. And then swinging this way, back in here, move a little bit, we're looking at probably I bet seven to eight year old aspen growth and this is thick it goes that way the loggers did a great job in this piece because you can see the big oaks they left just randomly placed throughout but I just cut through that and it is thick gnarly stuff so when thinking about a stand site we talk about deer being creatures of edge this spot right here would be a great edge to hunt because that is clearly the bedding the food is that direction you can see the main run right here so a tree like this would set up perfect to be able to hunt that transition from bedding into kind of an older growth stand and and then kicking the deer out towards the destination food um, in the evening so I've seen actually there was a way way better stand location um, further down this this spot but there are some kind of clear identifiers and my buddy wants to, me to keep this this piece of public on the down low so I didn't do a video over there but this is pretty cool right here just that transition from asp like probably seven year old aspen slash into just big mature aspen here and then with the food being out that way where i'm sure the deer are heading to lots of deer sign in here today too um pretty pretty neat little piece of public i, I know there's giants that run through this piece all right i might check back in at least once once or twice more all right so this spot here stands out because we have that aspen slash we got some small low areas um, and this is kind of a, almost a little island in the timber and it has a lot of white oak and bur oak just in this small little island so we're thinking early season stand location because that first couple weeks of season here the deer are heavy on the acorns and when looking at this piece of property here overall there's there's oaks but there's not a ton of oaks so this would be a great stand location because we have good trails and actually intersecting trails right here the trail that cuts up that direction we got the main run here and the trail kind of loops up over that way you can see old trails here and again we're scouting in the spring so I always talk about that uh, deer definitely change their patterns throughout the the summer and into the fall but for early season hunting this looks like a great spot because with the oaks being a limited resource in this area I think the deer are going to be in here heavy so should be a should be a good little spot to set up All right, so here's something else we're looking for as we scout around today is historical sign. 
We got some fresh rubs in this corner. Some old rubs. You can see an old rub there. And then another old rub right there. Here's the uh, the last sign that there's good deer in the area. So this is a young deer. I'm sure it's a two-year-old, but man, look at that potential. We got a little sticker kicking off there. We got a split G2, nice eye guards, pretty thick at the bases, but definitely a young deer. So you can tell there are good deer in this area. I mean, it's a shame he's not still kicking, not still running around, but we know this is a big deer area. So we know that there's potential for more like him. All right, you all take care. God bless.